Hi, I'm Taylor Wester from Stick a Fork in It, and today I'm going to be making cinnamon rolls and enchiladas for my sister, who just moved into the dorms. Now I'm doing two different recipes. I'm doing one with peanut butter because, you know, my sister doesn't like peanut butter, but I absolutely love peanut butter. Which about about a tablespoon sounds about right. And put some chocolate chips in. Now my sister absolutely loves M&M's, so I'm going to put a couple of M&M's just for fun. Just get about one package of them, they're only about 68 cents. Okay, after you put in your chocolate chips, you want to put about one cinnamon roll in. Just put about one dollop of butter. And that's just it. You'll have a great breakfast in just two minutes. All right, now that I've taken it out of the microwave, I'm gonna flip it over and stick it on a plate. Nice, warm frosting over the top. Okay. Now spread the frosting. The frosting's just gonna melt over. And that's it, you're all done. How'd you make this? Just stick it right in the microwave for two to three minutes. Genius. This is really good, and I'm probably gonna go off and buy some cinnamon rolls and make it in my dorm. So after making the cinnamon rolls, I'm gonna also make some amazing enchiladas. I use one large can, which is about two dollars, and I use one small can, which is about a buck, so about three dollars worth of chicken. After that, start breaking up your chicken a little bit. So it's kind of in a shredded sort of consistency. A chicken, a couple of tablespoons of refried beans, um, tomatoes with chilies, a little bit of enchilada sauce, and taco seasoning. And I kind of just broke it up and mixed it in. Now I'm going to chop up some tomato, bell pepper, and serrano peppers. Now the cutting board itself, I just got from the Dollar Tree, but you don't actually have to get one. You could just get one from, you just use a paper plate and chop with just just a knife, any sort of knife. So now that all my ingredients are in the bowl, I'm going to start assembling my enchiladas. So I'm going to put a couple spoonfuls in each tortilla, and then I'm going to roll it. Okay, so I just added the remainder of my sauce, some shredded cheddar cheese, and topped it with some olives and the remainder of the tomatoes. Now I'm just going to put in the microwave for at least four minutes. And here is our finished product. That's awesome. That's good? Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. You can find full instructions in my column in next week's Orion.